Hello my royal fans and welcome back to the channel for today's installment. Will Archie Harrison be allowed to work for the royal family now that Harry and Meghan have left royal life behind? When Meghan Markle and Prince Harry welcomed their first baby, Archie Harrison Mountbatten Windsor, in 2019, they opted against giving him a royal title. Although Archie Harrison does not have any official royal title, there is a way he could become an active member of the royal family, even with his parents out of the monarchy. So, will Archie Harrison get a title when Prince Charles is on the throne? As things currently stand, Archie does not have an HRH title, but that will change once his grandfather, Prince Charles, takes the throne. When Charles takes the throne, Archie Harrison will automatically be given a royal title. The only way that would not happen is if Charles overturned the 100-year-old decree and allowed Archie to retain his non-royal status. The royals have not commented on what will happen to Archie, but a source claims that Harry and Meghan, Duchess of Sussex, are okay with Archie becoming a prince. They just did not want it to happen upon his birth. Will Archie ever work for the royal family? If the decree is followed and Archie becomes a prince, upon Charles's ascension to the throne, then there would be an opportunity for Meghan and Harry's son to work on behalf of the monarch. The only catch is that Prince Charles would have to approve Archie's standing within the ranks of the royal family. Exactly when Charles inherits the crown is anyone's guess, and Archie growing up in the United States could complicate that transition. If Archie grows up in LA, thousands of miles away from other members of the royal family, there would be a bit of a learning curve if he wanted to join the royal family. That, of course, would not prevent him from becoming an active royal, but it certainly would not make things any easier. Prince Harry never wanted Archie to grow up as a royal. Harry and Meghan announced their exit from royal family at the beginning of the year. Although the couple had struggled in the royal spotlight, the move shocked many royal watchers. Dr. Jane Goodall, however, says that Harry and Meghan alluded to their exit at least six months before their announcement. According to page six, Goodall claims that Harry told her in the summer of 2019 that he does not want Archie Harrison to grow up learning royal protocols. Goodall added that she played with Archie Harrison and made him do the Queen's wave. When she remarked that he will probably have to learn that one day, Harry replied, hell no, he's not growing up like that. Whew. That seems a bit harsh. That's all for today, guys. Thank you for watching and all your support. Please like, comment, and subscribe. See you next time. Goodbye for now.